we did get the trucks lined up here and my dad should have another truck or two over here as well from his collection and we did get the Duramax set up in the shop so we got it all set up in here we got the tires all shined up too everything's really really nice and pretty it's all polished up looks good looks good and uh, we're super excited so now we're just waiting for them to show up he did call me and say that they're on their way so it shouldn't be long now so we are here about to be revealing to Noah his new Duramax thank you to everybody who participated in the giveaway and who participates in all the giveaways we highly appreciate it watching the videos and stuff but Noah's about to be seeing his Duramax which is a beautiful truck huge transformation it's it really has come a long way it's super cool for like 25 days for the time that we actually worked on it and uh, we've got a small lineup of trucks here and believe it or not this is like half of the trucks here wish we could have them all here but we've got some you know some of them are still being in the process of being worked on he's getting truck worked on i'm getting a dually worked on persians need some work done so a lot of stuff needs to get done still but we're happy to have the trucks that we can here and we think it's going to really top off the effect of him receiving his nice super cool truck and getting to have the experience of seeing all these ones here that he's seen on the videos and stuff too so super excited anything you want to say before they show up anything you're looking forward to anything in particular i've been to what two of these now um i think the very first the one thing. and then the one for the first gen mm -hmm. and i'll tell you what this is an exciting time just to be able to uh give away a truck and see their their expressions and uh I'm actually kind of excited right now just to see this lineup right here because it kind of so looks good. cool. Yeah. <laughs> it looks really good, but it's an overall good day. Oh yeah, it'll be fun. It'll be fun. So anyways, we're gonna we're gonna wait until they show up here and uh, hopefully they are extremely excited. It sounds like they are. Here's the guy. Nice to meet you. Welcome, welcome. No problem explaining this, right? No, not at all. What's your name? Nice to meet you, Brandon. Nice to meet you. Awesome. Nice to meet Welcome you, Austin. Welcome, Austin. Thank you, buddy. Thank Very you. nice. I love it. <laughs> this is my brother. This is my good buddy, Austin. Um, yeah, we were going to have the 24 valves come down here, but, you know, last day. It worked out. Usually how it goes. Yeah. What do you think of the display? <laughs> my heart dropped. Like, I'm like, like we got to make this, like, super cool <laughs> when they pull up. Like, and we're going to give you a moment, if you wanted to, you can look around at any of these trucks, ask us about any of them, just... Do whatever, and then of course your tricks sitting all polished up in the barn. But take a look around. Surely you're not excited about that, are you? <laughs> oh, I, I got to start on that. I mean, I couldn't really talk on the phone. I was going to talk to him a couple hood, of days afterwards. You know? Yeah, how do you want? Thinking the shock moment. <laughs> That's super cool. I mean, I'm it's not a perfect person. I, I, I was too much saying to find my own vehicle, and I know. Yeah, it's just crazy. Like I want here. It's a good one too. Look at the tack on that one. Come on, we're since we're popping a hood here, we'll show you. This one here is it's it's ready for wheels, tires, and body. We just have to get it all scheduled. Dusty needs washed up right now, but his didn't get tired. So so <laughs> yeah. dirty. So it don't this, this one's been neglected for the last uh, couple months here, either sitting in a dusty barn or. Uh, recently outside. Same you guys way. are from Michigan. You look like you're cold here. What's the deal? <laughs> I, I'm just nervous. <laughs> <laughs> like, you're not allowed to be cold in Michigan. Like, he you wants to see that to used to this. Yeah. yeah, like if I was telling um, my buddy Austin, you know, after my mom died, um, we just come home and watch YouTube videos. That's all we like to do, you know? Yeah. We learn a lot about trucks and watching them. So yeah, we got cool. you guys some hats, too. Oh, sweet. Sitting in the truck sweet. in there. So, yeah. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. When we pulled up, I'm like, we got all the trucks here, finally got them all together. I'm like, oh, wait, yeah, for sure. So we got the Dually, the, the other first gen, the 7 well, the 7 is wrecked, but then, you know, the Nasty Reds, Twin Turbo trucks at the shop getting work done, so it's like it's hard to get them all one spot. They're always worked on, but we try to get them all here. Yeah, so did, you, did you figure out what, the, what that leak was from? On the first gen? Yeah. Oh, that was, it's transmission something. It's red, which is, we just topped off all the fluids the other day. And it's exactly the same color for training fluid. So. It's transmission fluid. I just don't know where it's coming from because it's like from it's kind of like a, below the fan all the way back to the axle. Like it's everywhere out there. Yeah, this thing, uh, I'm like always in shock when I look at the frame of this truck. Cause it's just so clean. Like it is just so clean. It came out of, did it come out of Texas or Florida? Florida. Florida? Yeah, it's just, it is so clean. Angel Lamox. 
really good. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, it looks good. That looks really good. Thank I like you. Them, I yeah, like them yeah. headlights you got too. Yeah, I like them. He got them for me. He found yeah. them. And I really do like them. I can turn them on for you if you like. Awesome. Yeah, they do look good. I do like those headlights a lot. I wanted to get the like the fifth gen. Uh, 1500 style headlights for this because you can buy them now. $1,500. I'm like, really? Yeah, I can pull the trigger on it. Do we have any problems with the injection pump on, on, that, on this yet? On this truck, we thought we did, but then turns out it was just the lip pump. Whoever installed it originally, they probably did it in the shop at home, didn't know what they were doing. And the feeding line that goes into the tank is too short. So whenever she got below a half tank, it was starving for fuel, stalling out. So what was happening is she'd get below half and whenever she would like hit it from a stop and it shipped the fuel back, it would cut out fuel supply because all the fuel would shift back and the truck would saw and die. This thing, I'm kind of sad to get rid of it a little bit, but... So you're for sure getting that, that dually? I already put the money down on it, yeah. Awesome. But yeah, that truck's going to be... We're going to be the first ones on the internet to have a limited 3500 and building it. But for this one under the hood, all we have is the easy link tuning, we have the SMB cold air intake, the Banks Monster Ram, and then it's just got a straight pipe exhaust on it, but it's a lot of fun. It moves. For these big wheels and tires, it, it puts it down the road pretty quick. She would know too, because she randomly drove He's it. getting his last seconds with it before he's got to Yeah, say today goodbye. I was enjoying it. I was taking it fast everywhere. I'm like, I'm, I'm always babying this thing on the throttle, and I'm like, I just want to drive it. You can show them under the hood too if you want with the camera, because I haven't shown under the hood of this thing in a long time. Would you be able to start this one up? Oh, heck yeah. Yeah, yeah I'll fire it up. Let me get a snap to the video of this. <laughs> and do you have an Instagram? Yep. Yeah, I'm going to have to tag your Instagram in this because you're going to go up a few thousand. Ready? <laughs> uh, one second. Good. Yeah, so we did that upgrade um, when the turbo, the turbo didn't go out yet, but it was close, so we just went ahead and did it. And so this turbo's one, cheaper than an engine. yeah, right. exactly. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> turbo is cheaper than the engine for sure, but you can close, see that big bad boy back in there, <laughs> which we had, um, we had a big windstorm and a bunch of stuff from in this area blew out, but no. <laughs> <laughs> so we had that, the, the delete put on there and then um, it just runs so much better. Yeah. So we did that. Did you uh, see the videos too, to where they did, we did the 17 upgrade? Yeah. So it's a retrofit, yep. and then we did that. I didn't do any of the fancy piping yet, so we just kind of stuck with the, the cheaper stuff. But then we'll have some. I'll, I'll eventually get some color match stuff and upgrade, maybe even some of the air stuff a little bit more. But can you run push your theory? Maybe I talked to. Um, I talked to, to Jake. Him. Yeah. So I talked to Jake from Pusher uh, just the other day, actually, and they are actually making right now. It's not it's not done yet, but they're making, according to what he said, a system that will complement the 17 retrofit that I just put on there. So he's like, I'll call you. I'll let you know when it's ready. You know what I mean? So awesome. I'm excited to see because they've always done good for us. Gentlemen, what do you think about seeing a Duramax now? We've seen coming. You see a Duramax? Yeah, We've seen power see trucks. Should that's we take a look at a truck? Dirty max. You've seen our trucks. Why don't we look at yours? <laughs> All right, let's do it. <laughs> you tell me when you're ready. Yeah, no tears. <laughs> All right. You good? It is awesome. Actually, I did look at your order history and I saw that you've entered every giveaway. Yeah. Every giveaway he's entered. <laughs> and he actually, believe it or not, this is a long time ago. He had sent it a bunch of entries one time. <laughs> And I emailed told him about this told today. Him today. So this, this is a funny story. So I, I emailed him. I said, hey, man, I just want to let you know, like, we can't accept that many entries because it was a good stack of entries. But the point is, he's been persistent 
at entering the giveaways and participating stuff, five giveaways later, he's taking on a dirt bag. So think about that and uh, well, you see for yourself. <laughs> Not yeah, because like uh, <laughs> when I seen when I seen in like the info it was like okay one entry yeah. for thing was. Yeah. Well, it it paid off now, right? <laughs> you got his truck. Fire it up, man. It sounds good. It sounds good. You want me to fire it up? Oh, you do it. Oh, let's fire it up. It's not my truck. It's your truck. <laughs> there's another. There's another set of keys in the cup holder too. There. Well, we got this. What this the weight at all? Just depends how dirty he wants to get yeah, on the that's truck. True, right. get dirty. In my videos, people are always like, wash your truck, wash your truck. I'm like, dude, we do, but our driveways are bad. Got a truck going back up there. <laughs> and so far, none of the Michigan trips or trucks have fallen apart yet from rust. Like, no, <laughs> that was going to say, they've been, they've been pretty clean. clean. Like, what the heck? Yeah. yeah, that's what people always shock to like, uh, Michigan? Where'd you buy that from? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Sign print, suspension, yeah. like all the yeah. fall in the crap. It should be good. There you go. It's official. <laughs> Name's on the title. <laughs> that is, that First that drive. That feels real, you know? Oh, yeah. Like all my buddies are saying, oh, yeah, that's a scam. And we didn't really win that. And here we are, you know? Yeah, you're going to drive it back. <laughs> and he's going to be like, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> it's a good look, man. <laughs> <laughs> Pulling up to work on Monday. It's going to be looking good. Yeah. Actually, Tuesday, we're on 410. Right on. Where yeah. Like, so Monday, I can go down and get the title and stuff. Wait. You get a day to practice. <laughs> yeah. Whatever drive, let's go. Thanks. Yeah. The full tank of diesel. like oh coincidence that everybody wins within 10 12 hours i'm like first off if you drive 10 hours east you're gonna hit the coast you drive five hours you know north you're gonna hit canada if you drive 12 hours south you're gonna hit south carolina and be on the beach like like what kind of comment is that right. like half the country is 12 hours around like right. five different states five different trucks like for example him who called you first it was um the attorney? Yeah, the attorney. Yeah. I don't need like I don't get to cherry pick, it's all legally done, gone through, and then once it's confirmed, it's done, he's the winner, paper signed, you can call him, then I have permission. It's like that. You know what I mean? The crazy thing is this isn't even all <laughs> 
<laughs> it's yeah, like we had them all here. You'd have to have the same thing on the other side. I know. You'd have to. Yeah, you'd have to mirror the same thing over there. But yeah, let's get. I gotta get some last pictures. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> too. <laughs> Can never try to get a good deal because everybody's like, oh, I know. Well, I'll see you on It was huge. <laughs> your final thoughts on like your experience from the first time you started watching the videos to entering your first giveaway to this point and actually taking one of the trucks home. Like what's going through your head right now after all that, all that history? It's a remarkable feeling because you know, like I said, you know, things happened to my mother. Yeah. This is all we, this is all we would watch and you know, finally actually seeing these trucks in person. You know, it's unreal yeah for sure man and even even just like to come check them out that would, that would just my to day, see them you know yeah and what you're doing malachi is definitely something that a lot of people couldn't do you know yeah you're giving 110 percent you'll reap what you sold for sure man i like the way you think you're a good dude man i appreciate that this is obviously ready for wheels and tires 20 by 12s anthems plug um yeah plug <laughs> <laughs> and then so the question your opinion should I take the bed off, keep the bed, just, you know, so I have it if I want to, and pull it, put a flat bed like Nasty Red on here? <laughs> flat bed. With stance. With stance, because we're going to have, you know, obviously the stance. Would this not make a cool, or show, or show I just get the body work done, you know, have them fix that? So what's, your, think, what's your vote? What you could do is still just get the bed repaired so it's nice in case you want to put it back on because this bed like when you look inside of it it's perfect like there's nothing other than, wrong the with it. Other, the other than this and this which they'll fix easy enough but the bed's not dented up in there never been used as an actual truck take it off store it and just store it with a tarp over on some pallets i think you should make it how it looked in 92. i think that'd be pretty sweet just More original keep it, keep it original there's none beats a original first gen you know it's true. It's I hard saw, to find. I saw another one like this for sale, but it had like 285,000 miles on 12.5. It was in Michigan, right There's up towards you Michigan, guys. Right? <laughs> but it had yeah. all the moldings on it and everything. I'm like, ooh, just remember, <laughs> there's always the rest of your truck somewhere. <laughs> somewhere. There's one in my driveway. <laughs> that, right there. Just to take that home, and it's just truly amazing. Like, yeah. <laughs> well, it's, uh, it's his ringtone now. Yeah. Yeah. No, I was going to put on my story, but <laughs> like I said, it's just really cool to like see people like get amped up for this stuff, you know, and to see that we share the same like likes and passions, passions and, all, and yeah. all that good stuff. And it was just great to know that he was the one that got it because he's well deserving of it. Yeah. yeah. Like yeah. he's just a good guy at heart, honest to God. It's just cool. Like oh, yeah. it's about time, you know, he's got something cool to drive, you know. <laughs> <laughs> to show up the boys at home and, for sure uh, oh yeah he's got a heck of a truck yeah it is a heck of a truck we've ridden in it <laughs> yeah and uh i told I'm him happy. i'm like yeah for sure and i thought i'm like honestly i was never a huge chevy fan until i, I bought a chevy diesel and drove it and i'm like holy crap i'm like this thing is like ride yeah. soft it's got tons of power with just a basic yeah. tuner and intake stuff like it just puts it down like it's cool does. It's a really fun and truck. You feel Handles it. well. You feel it. The steering is not like <laughs> <You're> right, <laughs> like a Dodge. <laughs> Okay, you're gonna be in this. Not her. <laughs> <laughs>
She's got her own channel. Sorry, it's not that she's not good. You, I you're mean, you're wasting uh, my camera wait, space. Sorry. Can you okay. please? Okay, go. No, but in all seriousness, we just crossed our links at the same time. <laughs> Why did we do that? So, no, we just undid it at the same time. Cross your legs. There, it's good. Okay, we're good. Gosh. But anyways, about the giveaway. Oh yeah, so about the giveaway. Those guys just left, and they were here for a long time, but it was good. We had a really yeah. good conversation with them, and even when he was out there, they were, you know, they were both talking to me about how, even like with what they were doing, they feel like they're burning out, they're not enjoying it anymore, and this and that, and they're stressed. And I'm like, and I was trying to tell them about, you know, my journey and this and that, and they were talking about how you, how do you create that new opportunity? How do you go to that next level? And all this sort of stuff, bunch of different points, some deeper stuff, some more, you know, heart to heart stuff, but. It was nonetheless like a really cool experience. And one thing that I kind of thought was cool was that he was this guy. So, so Noble, the guy that actually won the truck, when the very first giveaway ever launched, he had sent me 250 in the first batch of postcards for entries because it says one entry, you know, whatever. But he thought it meant like one entry per postcard. And he sent them to you know to our personal address, but the point that being, ever since then, I was just like, hey man, I appreciate your support. You can't send that many postcards, <laughs> and like it doesn't work like that. But ever since then, he's been, he's entered at least three entries in every giveaway because he's been believing, he's been believing for, I'm believing for this truck, I'm believing for this truck, I'm the, not necessarily any one truck in particular, but like that that he that he'll that he'll win someday, you know, and um, it's a little bit deeper. I I take it a little bit more in a deeper sense than like. What a lot of people might think, but like he was believing for that, for for this moment today, that he would be driving one of those trucks someday. You know what I mean? Like that's what he was he was hoping for, and that's what he was pursuing. And you get a truck. Like his story and background is actually really cool. You know what I mean? Like, and how he's he's like, I'm just I just want to be a leader. I'm just always trying to train people, help people, doing this, and I wanted to take it to another level. And so I'm, you know, trying to get into the Air Force, and I want to serve my country, and it's just, he's a very deep guy, yeah. and there's just a lot there, just a lot of heart, you know what I'm saying, and it was just a really good experience, and you just, like, when he drove away in the truck, he just, he shook my hand, like, five times, just like, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank just like, thank you so much, dude, he's like, I, I needed this, like, today, just with what we talked about, and the heart to heart, and just talking, he's like, I needed that a lot, he's like, I've been going through a lot of tough stuff, and, you know, when he lost his mom, and he's like, I needed today like that was everything I needed not, it's not about the truck he's like it's just everything that we talked about and just perspective and just it was a big deal you know what I mean to all of them and uh, he left with a lot more than the truck and that's always the goal so like with Noah and Brandon Austin it was both um, I mean you guys are stand-up guys I really appreciate you just coming out and giving us the opportunity to be able to meet you and share some of our heart in those just that time together so that's something that I know Malachi and I both cherish and so we're very very grateful and uh, it, it's true though, like with some of the stuff that we were just talking about one-on-one, -on -one, it, it's not just a truck. Like like you were saying, Malachi, like with him putting in the effort and like what we were telling him, you know, to have that element of belief and that element of hope, but then also just like the focus and intent that he put into that, there's something about like, you know, like just having such like a, a deep desire and like what turned out is like, he didn't get the fruit of that truck, that first truck, like it was big stink. But right? he got it. But, you know, but you got he, it the fifth time around. You know but I mean? the thing like, about it is, is like, yeah, it's like what he, he ended up with because he, he stayed in pursuit was he ended up with something technically better. You know what I mean? Yeah. Technically substantially better. Not that the other truck isn't a nice truck, but it just turned out good. You know what I mean? And so it's just encouraging because everybody that we've come in contact with so far, like face to face, they've been good hearted, genuine good people. people. And it's just been a delight to be able to interact and meet with folks. And so I just want to applaud like the audience, like in terms of. When you're buying like the, the merch and stuff like that, like, thank you for that first off. But like, because and and I'm sure Noah and Austin, all those guys will be saying the same thing because you guys participating in that, those guys walked away with more than a truck. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. and, the, and that couldn't have happened without our time being put in and your in your time within watching the videos and participating in all stuff because you just changed somebody's life. Just think about that. It's a lot deeper than a truck. Yeah. And like I always say in my videos, I'm like, by the way, when you come down to get this truck you're leaving with more than a truck. And I mean that in a sense mm -hmm. like this, you know what I mean? Like, it's not like, so it's like, oh, you got a cool truck, it's worth this much. It's like, it's not about that. It's like, it's a cool truck, it's a great truck. When you're able to leave with a truck in something that can, um, that can almost like catapult you or take you to another, um, just another level of blessing, 
I think that's just really cool. And you don't necessarily know sometimes how those blessings will arrive in life, but they arrive. And that, I mean, even just today was a blessing for us just to be able to meet those guys. So, I mean, again, thank you for your time, uh, Noah and Austin um, but, um, and Brandon. But it was a really good day. Can I do the peace thing too, like you do? You like, can you show me how to do it. Yeah, like that. yeah, see, I feel dope now. Yeah, I feel dope. <laughs> no, no! I feel dope, man. Like, no, but thank you guys so much for watching. Thanks for all the love and support and participating in the giveaways. You have a huge announcement coming up. Stay tuned because uh, it's about to get really Stop. good. It's about to get really good. So, thank you guys so much. Comment down below, leave a fat thumbs up on this video. Subscribe if you're new, join the team, join the family, and I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.